There are two main methods of adding in roofs in BD. This video will look at adding a simple roof using a separate eave line. However, please also see the other video on roofs in this tutorial series, which focuses on the roof generator tool. The first step in creating a simple roof is to define the eave line for it. However, first we need to ensure that we are in the 2D architectural roof modeling pair with the walls we want to see at the roof on quick loaded as a reference drawing. With that done, go to the roof menu in the modeling tab and select the eave line command. Notice the options for different roof types as well as quick options for roof overhangs displayed in the contextual toolbar. In this example, we want a roof type for trusses, so hit this button to be taken to the parameters for this type. If the help button is clicked, this brings up a helpful diagram for the different parameters that you can refer to. First select the material code that will allow you to select a roof type from the pre-existing library. Note, others can be added, but will be in a separate video in this series. This will automatically change the top chord field. Next, the pitch can be altered, making sure that the value entered has the capital A suffix. Fascia height can also be changed to suit. Next, we can define the various height and overhang parameters. The first will be the top plate height that the roof will sit on. Either type this value in manually if known, or simply click the Get button to choose either from the 2D or 3D models. Now simply choose the wall and the plate height field will change accordingly. Next we have a set of three values that need two defining before using the Calculate button on the third to define that value. This is based on all of the parameters for this roof. For instance, if an overhang value is defined here, and then an over the wall height value defined here, then press Calculate next to the Eve height field to obtain the correct value. Once defined is required, click OK to begin adding the Eve line. Here, simply hover near the external edge of the wall, noticing the diagonal line appearing on the cursor. Click to add the line and then continue around the walls that are to be used, confirming once selected. The final step is to add the roof itself. Roof types are available from the roof menu in the modeling tab. Upon clicking, notice the guide diagram to assist in picking the points of the roof. It is important to pick the points in the correct order to ensure the ridge line and the pitch are in the correct direction. Now pick the three points, confirming afterwards, and the roof slopes will be added. This concludes our video on adding in roofs. Thank you for watching.